this part of the process is where the treated timbers are left to air dry and they will stay in this environment for about 90 days, plus or minus 90 days. And what's happening here, Mother Nature, through the movement of air current, through, as you can see, this separation between uh, the layers and between the timbers, and there's enough separation there to allow the moisture, when they come, when they come out of the treating process, they are literally expanded with the amount of material that's injected and pressured into the logs. Uh, and that's a key to our finished product. All of this is a key. It's also a key that they get some air drying time to allow that moisture to be relieved as much as possible. Uh, and as the moisture is relieved, the solids that are put in there begin to solidify. And that's when the real work is being done by the uh, polyethylene glycol. That's the primary ingredient that we're putting in. And also the boil rate and some of the other things. Uh, there's so much moisture coming out during this period. If there was enough separation between these stacks, even on a day which is a little milder temperature, you could walk between these stacks of wood and it'd feel like you're walking through an air conditioning room. And that's just really describes how much moisture is being relieved out of the wood. Now we're ready for the next step. We'll take it from here to the milling process.